All right, the new cropping feature for image batch has been released in a free update, so I will be running through the process of cropping a batch of images. Again, I've set up a folder of 20 images to be processed, so let's begin by selecting that folder. And we can move to the crop tab. The output folder name automatically changed, but you can change that to whatever you like. So on the crop tab, we are first presented with the crop by aspect ratio screen. Here you can enter any aspect ratio you want and image batch will crop all of your images to the center. It automatically finds the largest dimension of each image with their height and will crop that dimension down. So let's enter a simple aspect ratio of one to one and click process. As you can see, the output folder was created inside of our selected folder. And if we take a look inside, all of our images are now cropped to an aspect ratio of one to one. The second screen that is available for the crop feature is the crop by exact size screen. You can get there by flipping the exact size switch. Here you can enter an exact width and height to crop images down to. Again, image batch will automatically crop to the center of each image. So let's enter a width of 500 pixels and a height of 800 pixels and click process. And if we check the output folder, all of the images have been cropped down to 500 by 800.